Cal. Saturday, up in Bowles Gap, they will celebrate the classic TV show, The Dukes of Hazard, with Hazard boy. Fest. And actor mm -hmm. John Schneider is among the stars from the show that's actually going to be at the event. Now, the actor is known not just for his acting, but for his compassion. He truly cares about others. One Hawkins County family shares their incredible interaction with John Schneider and how it's helped their brave daughter. Daughter Donna Joy was born with uh, five normally fatal brain disorders back in 1991. And in fact, they said she would probably die not long after birth. We fought through different things and she just powered right through and she's a real fighter. And uh, she started to do pretty well. But three years ago, her shunt, which is what controls the hydrocephalus, uh, it broke and she, her health began to decline. What we were told by the specialists in Nashville um, and a couple of other, other places was to pretty much just take her home and enjoy her for now, that what was going on was not operable anymore. She had already had eight brain surgeries and uh, there was no way to continue. There was no way to fix the, the problem now. I'm also an author and I was working on a book this past January and uh, John Schneider was part of it, part of what I was researching for the book. And she was sick one day and it was after the start of the coronavirus. So we were all kind of um, huddled in together and she climbed up on my bed and said, mommy, what you doing? And I was looking at some old clips of the Dukes of Hazard. You know, I hadn't thought of him in like 40 years since I was a young girl. And um, she kind of took to him. She said, well, who's that? Over, over time, I was introduced to his wife, Alicia, and through, through email and through different people that I knew from uh, just being an author and a speaker. And it seemed that we had mutual friends in the business. And uh, we were able to introduce Donna Joy to John over the summer at his birthday party at his home in Louisiana. And there was some kind of special connection there. And it just seemed like that whole weekend, I had taken down there this frail sort of fragile girl. And what came back was this completely, you know, different person got this sparkle back in her that we hadn't seen. Um, she was no longer staying in bed 24 hours a day. She was up and running around. She got this color back in her cheeks and uh, this light back in her eyes. It was just like someone had flipped a switch on. And uh, she's a, it's just like we got our little girl back and you can't buy. And um, I think there really are angels among us. And I think he and his wife, Alicia, definitely are, are too. They, they are such kind and genuine people with such a heart for others. Um, they've kept in touch with her. Everything else that he's, that he's doing, his music and everything, that he has time to, to keep in touch with her, with her and, and with us. And, you know, he, he sent her this the other day. Um, he, she keeps the fire bed and she kisses it good night. Um, And Hazard Fest is Saturday from 10 to 10 p.m. at the Volunteer Speedway in Bulls Gap. Lori says she and Donna Joy will be able to see the star. All right.